Hey everyone, it's Tay. This is my first hair tutorial video and I'm super duper excited about it. Um, this video is basically just going to talk about the hair products that I use, what helps my hair grow, what makes it longer. So I'm going to show you how long my hair is now. It's about that long. My goal is to grow my hair to about my elbow. I always wanted my hair that length. So right now, I'm really pushing to get to that point. Um, I'm going to talk more about the products that I use after I freshly wash and deep condition my hair so that you can see how I apply certain products. So I'll be right back. About to wash my hair. And we'll talk more in a minute. Cool. So, hey everyone, I'm back. <clears throat> and my hair is freshly washed and deep conditioned. It looks washed. Well, it's not like, you know, um, soaking wet. It's kind of damp now because I toweled, I towel dried it. But the products that I use is, I use Mazzani. I use Mazzani um, scalp care shampoo. Very nice product. I love Mazzani products. Been using it, I say, for over five years now. I love Mazzani. Um, the only thing I don't like about the shampoo is that after you wash your hair, your hair feels kind of dry, like kind of brittle. I guess it kind of strips your hair a little bit more than you would probably want it to do. If you have natural hair, it would probably be really good for your natural hair. You probably would like the feeling that it leaves, but since my hair is relaxed, I don't really like how it leaves my hair feeling that dry right after I wash, uh, shampoo it. But to save the day is Mazzani's uh, Moisture Fusion Conditioner. It's a silk cream conditioner. I use it right after I shampoo my hair. I put it in my, I massage it through my hair and then I comb through so that it can uh, get throughout my whole head. I had to use more than a dime size amount. I hate to be saying, to see the dime size. No, for me, I don't use a dime size because I have a lot of hair. My hair is pretty bigger than most people, but I comb it through so that I can get through my hair um, on my scalp, massage it through, and I leave it on for a couple minutes and then I just rinse it out. So now we're at the point where I just finished using that and rinse it out, towel dried it, now my hair is damp. So I'm trying, I actually said before that I was going to use one new product, but I'm actually trying two new products today, tonight. Um, the first product I'm trying is Influence Stimulating Conditioner. Um, this is good to stimulate and it soothes the itchy scalp and softens and detangles your hair. So um, it smells good. I love good smelling products. Smells minty fresh. I like minty fresh. Um, forgot to mention that both of Mazzani products smell very good. I definitely recommend uh, these products for you all who wants nice, clean feeling hair. Uh, it definitely does what it says it's supposed to do. So now what I'm about to do is apply this to my hair, apply the stimulating conditioner to my hair. I'm going to massage it through and uh, then I'm gonna put a cap on it afterwards and leave it on for a little while. Okay, so I just finished conditioning my hair with the Influence, oops, with the Influence uh, Stimulating Conditioner. I left it on my hair for about 10 minutes and my hair feels very soft. So I'm very pleased with that. Very soft, very fresh. My scalp feels good. 
so this might be a winner with this conditioner but what I'm about to do now I hate my hair sheds is use Mazzani's detangle spray um, I'm gonna spray gradually down my hair brush it out with my tangle tangler you can get this from Sally's I don't think it was that much it was like a dollar if even that maybe two so I'm just gonna spray this throughout my hair mainly at the ends because that's where my tangles usually come but you can just spray this wherever your um, tangles usually are your hair so spray a little bit and you don't have to spray that much spray as much as like you think that you need me personally I spray just enough so that I don't have to keep spraying it throughout the process so that's all it's just it's a moisturizer leave-in milk as well that's what it says and I always work from the ends and then gradually work my way up. And this is my first time using this brush because I hate using um, combs and like it just gets stuck all up in the tangles. It don't do my hair no type of justice. So this is actually doing a pretty good job. Um, don't be alarmed if your hair sheds. I have a tendency of being alarmed with that. I don't know. I just have this thing when I see hair coming out. It just, I don't know, it does something to me. I always just immediately jump to the conclusion of my hair is falling out. Even though realistically, it's just shedding. But that's just me. So, I'm going to get out all the tangles because... don't want it to be tangled after this process of when I apply the oils to my hair. I want it to be nice and smooth. Um, by the way, <clears throat> I am using, um, I'm going to let my hair air dry because my blow dryer broke about a week or two ago. That's just depressing itself. It's alright though, because I've had that blow dryer since probably eighth grade, so it's about time it broke. But that's a good that was a good blow dryer. So because my blow dryer broke, that um, I'm gonna air dry my hair and also because I'm trying to get in the habit of not blow drying my hair a lot. I don't want that heat damage to my hair. Um I just want um, to get in the habit of letting it air dry so that my hair can be a little more healthier and not be damaged. 